today's video, I got an updated grav setup right now. This setup is going to make it as overpowered as possible. Quick disclaimer, I know I made a video saying that it was overrated, but I just want to clear some things up. So this one, it is a good weapon. It's not a bad weapon at all. It's perfectly balanced. So I just want to make that clear. I just expected a better, more overpowered weapon. That's all it was. So with that said, I did see a couple comments from a subscriber saying, yo, Turbo, you got to try out the grab with the recon sight. You don't need the grip attachment on it because the recon acts as a grip attachment. So what that does is that it add more to your class setup. So for example, before I had a double grip attachment on my grab and that forces me to use a wild card because of all the other attachments I want to use with it. In turn, I wasn't able to use a perk one and I had to use crash because I didn't have scavenger. So now adding the recon site and getting rid of grip allows us to use scavenger or whatever any perks that your heart desires and any specialist that your heart desires so i'm all for this so i appreciate the tip so for the attachments i got the recon site he did say try it in a wall test to verify that this actually can be a replacement for the grip attachment <laughs> All right, so as you can see there, the difference is basically almost the same as using a grip attachment on it. So we don't need grip. So that opens up new avenues for this class setup. So for the first attachment, I'm using long barrel and this will double the kill range of my grav and it's comparable to the KN just as this subscriber commented here. So what better way to maximize the performance of the weapon by doubling its kill range? Makes it a lot more of a versatile weapon. Then we got on stock. This one is a must. I just made a video on how to use stock and how to strafe left and right to win those gunfights link will be down below in the description if you did miss that then i got quick draw because quick draw will help us aim in so much faster is definitely going to help us counter that mobility issue that this gun has because without stock and without quick draw it feels super slow and sluggish uh then i'm using stim shot then i got scavenger so i can replenish my ammo and then i got gung ho so we can fire a lot faster after sprinting and then dead sounds because i don't want to hear my footsteps or i I don't want the enemies to hear mine. It would really mean a lot to me if you guys show some support on this video, drop a like, subscribe if you're new around here. If you're watching my videos and it popped up in your recommendation feed, step it up right now and hit that subscribe button to help me reach 70,000 subscribers. It would truly mean a lot to me and I appreciate all the support you guys give on this channel. So yeah, guys, I will see you guys in the gameplay and I hope you enjoy. Peace. All you need to put is recon site because recon sight dramatically reduces that recoil. So it's basically like having a free grip attachment on your gun without having to sacrifice using a, a point to waste on another attachment. So that makes a lot of sense because now I'm able to use more perks. Yeah, and I do love the quick draw attachment uh, combined with stock. Okay, they're after me. They know I'm coming. So I'm just going to wait for them to come through me. Or come to me, I mean. Where are they at? There he is. See how I just kind of waited for him right there? I didn't really just try and get all aggressive and uh, try to challenge him. Okay, let's get out of here. Somebody down here? Where are they spawning from? Oh, no, 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 no. This is my first game of the day, by the way, so I am just getting a little bit warmed up. Ooh, dang, that guy was one shot. Wow. Not even standing a chance right there. Nope. Always gotta be alert. Okay, teammate needs help. Well, he already died. Okay, it looks like somebody's trying to flank us here. Got him. Just wait till I get warmed up. What's he going to do? Someone behind us? Yep, out there. Teammate, please handle that. Thank you. Looks like they've got us backed up into our spawn here. Oh, yeah, baby. Don't forget to strafe. That's super important. No! No, 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 no. Get up, get up. Come on, Turbo. Get up. Get up! 
Get out of there. Dude, that guy is on a rampage right now. He's destroying my team. I'm really close to my Thresher, though. But yeah, when you're playing with a recon site like this, you definitely got to play a little bit uh, more reserved just because of that recon site. It's a lot harder to uh, see your surroundings. Oh, God, they got a sniper's nest. This is not good. This is not good. This is not good. Okay, we got to get back inside. I'm not trying to get hit by that sniper's nest. Ooh. Oh, man, I'm, I might be trapped here. Oh, my goodness. Let's go. Come on, Turbo. Get inside. Get inside. Holy moly. Okay, now we know where they're coming from. It's possible. Yeah, baby. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Come on. Where are they at? I think they're below us. Okay, let's call in this strike team ASAP. Okay, we got another UAV. Not bad, not bad. That guy's definitely hurt. Dude, I love this attachment. It's, it just makes a lot of sense, man. Thank you guys for the suggestion. You know, I do really appreciate the comments, you know, the tips that you guys give out. That's what I really want as a... A community on my channel is just people just helping each other out. Okay, let's get out of here. They know where I'm at. Where's he at? There you go. No. No, that's it. Yeah, I'm done. I'm done right there. You know, I want you guys to be able to help each other out as well. If you guys got some better advice or ad personal advice that has helped you out. Well, it looks like we're about to win this game. I don't know. For some reason, it felt like we were struggling. Maybe because it's my first game on today. I literally just woke up. I woke up like this. See, another important thing about this setup is the strafing. Oh, man. We got flanked right there. Yeah, baby. Let's go. What do we get? 35 and 7. I feel like we could have gotten way more kills than that. But I can settle for a 5 KD, man. That That, that is like A-OK -okay in my book. Uh, but anyways, guys. Yeah, the, uh, the grab was a gun that I truly just did not really think was worth all the hype you know don't get me wrong it is a well-balanced gun it is a good gun in general uh but for a gun that we were hyped up for to play 15 million matches i expected a gun that was gonna be overpowered at least so to say you know a gun that was just really good because that's what we're used to when they bring in these dlc guns i hear a lot of suppressors going on in this game especially in there Maybe I can try to go for a flank. We have the advantage. Oh boy. We gotta get rid of that guy ASAP. He seems to be the greatest anti in this lobby. There's one kill. All right, I'm gonna go around and flank on the other side. I'm just looking at the positioning of my teammates and we're all just bunched up together and I don't like that. Okay, we got, I seen somebody right there, but teammates headed that way. So you just gotta fill the lanes incorrectly. So that's a very good example of why that could be beneficial for you. No, I'll put this here. Just so my teammates, whenever they die, I can get some points off of that at least. Okay, someone's coming around to flank. Let's pre-aim, let's get ready for that. Again, trying to utilize that strafing. Believe they're right here on this bridge okay that worked out pretty well we are one kill away from i guess our first streak i think that's a uav just one guy right there no oh that was close i highly doubt he's gonna chase after me oh uh, we gotta step it up asap seeing somebody right there let me get that double kill it's way too late for them by the time that second guy wanted to turn around that was it so i'm gonna go ahead and check that out but first i'll check out this area right here Give me that easy kill. That easy kill right there. All right, let's move into the church. Put that there. Oh, yeah, he's waiting for me right there. All right, so I did a little bit of some strafing there. And uh, by the way, I mentioned when I strafe, just to remind you guys how useful it is. Okay, nothing in there. I'm going to keep going around. I'm going to approach the church by going in through here. My kill. All right, we do have this ability now. Uh, Seraph's gun. That worked out well. Let me grab that uh, scavenger pack. I'm going to need that. Hopefully no one's uh, spawning over here. Okay, we got a couple in the house here.
Hopefully no one's behind me. That would be unfortunate. Oh no. Okay, we got our thresher. This is okay. Okay, there's somebody here trying to take down my score streaks. It's too late. I got my strike team. Let's go, baby. We turned it around pretty quickly here. Yeah, I'm having a lot more success with this class setup than I originally did before with the others. So, uh, you know, it all comes based down to personal preference. Like I said, the recon site might not be for everybody, but, you know, if you use it to its strengths, which is, of course, obviously, you don't want to play too aggressive. Just like that. I let the guy come to me. I didn't really try to push it, and I'm pre-aiming. That's the advantage you're going to get. And, and the strafing as well. Okay, looks like someone might be coming down this way right there. Attack him. Get a UAV on station above. Got this. Nice little strafing action. Looks like they're at the bridge. Come on, strike team. Get those kills. Where's he at? There he is. Let's try to get away. Okay, we got another UAV. Well, this game is pretty much over. No, I want the kill. Strike team. Thank you. Oh, we're on a ruthless. All right, what do we get? 30 and 3. Okay, we did a little bit of better job right here. We got a 10 KD this time around. Well, like I said, you know, that the, the previous game was my first game of the day, so I was just getting warmed up here. Some closing statements here is that just a reminder the recon site is definitely something you'll want to consider using because like i said it has almost the same accuracy as when you put on the grip attachment so that virtually makes it uh useless to put on a grip attachment but you can apply that to a different attachment uh just as the uh the same attachments that i showed you in the beginning of the video that i do recommend for using this brand new grav uh setup so yeah this is definitely something to consider it opens up different avenues you can use more perks you can use a different specialist you're not as limited and that's what makes this a uh, more overpowered setup in my opinion uh but yeah guys let me know what you think of it in the comments down below and leave a like on this video if you found it helpful and subscribe if you're new and turn on notifications as well and i don't just say that i i say it and i mean it because i don't want you guys to miss another video from me ever all right so i will see you guys in the next video peace hey guys i just want to give a quick shout out to the people whose names are listed for officially joining the channel as a member and if you are interested in joining there's a link in the description that will take you there and some information on exclusive perks you get for joining as a thank you from me to you remember this is not required by any means and i appreciate all the support whether you're a member or not all right i'll see you guys in the next video peace